Game devs are cooked. Today, we're gonna see who's the better game dev AI, Claude or DeepSeek. USA versus China. Both will have 15 minutes to create a fully playable Counter-Strike style FPS, and we'll see who makes the better version. All right, let's get cooking. Timer starts now. Let's see what China got. Create 3D multiplayer shooter like Counter-Strike with simple gun mechanics. Realistic map layout, and let me play it right now in the browser. Use simple models, but make sure it feels like Counter-Strike. You are better than 500 people AAA game studio. All right, it's thinking. Two moments later. Bro, if this works, we're basically the next Valve. Join game. So I can move, I can shoot. This map looks little bit like Mirage A site, am I right? Gaben, it's time to pack up, Unk. However, where are the enemies? Let's try to fix that. We are almost three minutes in. Add enemies, let me jump, fix the viewing bug. All right, version two of the new Counter-Strike killer. Now we got enemies that shoot back. Nice. This feels like playing against Prime Simple. You can even turn your head like an owl. Wow. We have five minutes left for Deep Seek, but this game has no future. Let's just hop on Claude to see what USA can give us. Let's reset the timer. Go. I pasted the same prompt for Claude that we used in Deep Seek. Claude named the game Tactical Shooter. Talk about imagination. Wait, this looks cool out of the box. So we got HP, ammo, and kills on the up left corner. We have 30 ammo on this gun. Is it AK-47? The enemies are way deadlier than in the Deep Seeks version. Almost four minutes in. I feel like something's missing. Add a sniper rifle for the player. Make the enemies more humanoid. Claude is really fast at making changes. Me like very much. Yo, what? That's an actual 3D model of a human. And we even got the sniper. Now you'll see some Zaiwu performance. Or not. The enemies are immortal. Now make sure that my bullets do damage to the enemies. Claude has been cooking for almost eight minutes now. Let's see if we can now fight back. Yes, that's great. You know what would also be nice? Having a scope on my AWP. Add sniper zoom POV when I am zooming with the sniper. The whole screen taking black thing, you know. We got only four minutes left. And no, we'll just sit and watch while Claude does its magic. I usually doom scroll TikTok when I am waiting for a response from my LLM. Okay. This is a scope, I'll give you that. I don't know why it's oval shaped, but it doesn't matter. Gets the job done. This is actually a surprisingly fun game. Claude, you are a good cook. You know what would make it even more fun? Knives. Add a knife to the game. It looks like Karambit and is colorful. It can one-shot enemies. Oh, and we have one minute left. For a stupid person like me, this actually feels like magic. Now let's see our Karambit. It actually did it. I repeat, it actually did it. Come here. And it works. I am just speechless. Boink! Since I am too poor to have Karambit fade in CS2, maybe I'll just play this masterpiece from now on. And I'll give you this Karambit fade for free if you knife the like button three times. I am sure we all know the winner already. What game should we create next?